The process of manufacturing a bicycle involves many tasks and many parts. There is planning involved, there is logistics as well, and also tracking which part came from where. We're going to look here in three short demos that will cover the planning, the transport and traceability of the manufacturing process. Let's start with the planning. The production has to match what is forecasted as sales. That means that you will need extra parts from suppliers to be ready to make the bicycles when you need to make them. In this case, we see from the forecast there is 10 issues. Suppliers might not be able to give you what you need. In this case, we see a supplier telling us that they cannot commit to 4,000 brake pads. They can only commit to 2,000. So we need to find another supplier for the missing parts. But where did that forecast came from, that 4,000? Well, planners like to use Excel, so we simply added the connectivity from Excel to the business network and they can share their forecast so that the supplier can tell, well, in this case, I cannot do 4,000, I can only do 2,000. Armed with this information, you can flip around and check on the business network if there are suppliers that could fill this gap and make sure you've got everything needed for your production. You've made lots of space in your warehouse to receive a large shipment for supplies that you need to manufacture your bicycle. Hmm, there is trouble. There is delays and congestion in the port of Bangkok that will affect your shipment. The system tells you that there is 1.6 million revenue that will be affected if this doesn't get resolved. You even see that there is eight days predicted delays. You urgently need to find a new supplier for this. And the forecasting planning tool we saw before will take care of that. Having immediate access to information as it happens is the best way to protect that 1.6 million revenue by making sure you get supplies in your warehouse when you need them. If a consumer is able to scan a QR code and get information such as carbon emission and certification, that might make him choose to buy this product. For the manufacturer, this is one of the outcome of tracking quality and traceability of the materials. The alert he just saw on the business network informs him that a supplier is having issues and that might affect different lines of production. We can see three of them here. Think of three different bicycles, for example, all of which will be affected by that one single supplier. So action needs to be taken. In the same way, the system provides the genealogy of everything. Think of carbon emission. It needs to be tracked at every single parts and every single supplier so that you can accumulate them and offer information like we saw before in an app for the consumer. And with this, we saw how the business network of SAP enables the tool for manufacturing to be powerful, collaborative, and get everything that is needed in order to get those bicycles on the road as soon as possible.